Hey everyone, so today we are going to be doing a pro standard tutorial on this type of card layout. We are just going to go ahead and get started. Most of the codes you shouldn't have to change just as long as you make the elements in the order that I'm making them. The only one is for the highlight, which is the big text here. You can change the colors of the gradient, obviously to your liking, which is what you will do here. But that should be about it and you would have to change it for all the highlights and you could even do different colors for each highlight. But that should be about it. Everything else should roughly stay the same. Positioning though might need to be adjusted specifically for the media only screen. I believe I have different settings for mobile on two elements, the text and then the container here. So that might need to be adjusted depending on your mobile screen, but everything else should be roughly the same.
This is container number four and the positioning for this container as it's the only one that's absolutely positioned might have to be changed depending on your device size but since nothing else is absolute positioning it should fit all your devices um, and since this is a bit it looks a bit big on mobile you can always adjust the page size for mobile to make it smaller to fit your screen so it doesn't look like it's going like off screen if that makes sense and I did forget to mention but to change the text at the top I just wanted to make it clear you do it here obviously you would want to replace doll cards with whatever your username is For these embeds, wherever it says info or, you know, text goes here or blah, 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 anywhere where it's pretty obvious that I put filler text is where you can add your own text, but you don't want to change any other part of the code unless obviously you know what you're doing. But I'm not super familiar with um, CSS, so that's why I've just left it how it is in the reference card. Alrighty, and here's what your final result should look like. As usual, if you need any help, please let me know in the comments down below. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. I really appreciate it. And I will see you all in the next one. Bye-bye.